right now, based on uh, you know the common denominators, uh, the similarities of the victims, where they were dumped, the dismemberment, uh, you know, it looks like one person. Uh, yeah, and the fact that Manorville uh, remains that were found in 2000 and 2003 are now connected to remains found years later at off Ocean Parkway. And the two legs found off Davis Park in 96, which is 15 years ago, connected to remains found off Ocean Parkway. Uh, you know, again, that leads to the theory that it's one person using this area as a dumping ground and dismembering the bodies so that the police could not identify them if they were found. When the Asian male was found, uh, you know, that was unusual. We thought that was, uh, you know, out of the ordinary, a male with all the females. But then he was wearing women's clothes. He was of slight build possibly involved in the sex trade. That's the theory. Uh, then the toddler, of course, was another issue that didn't fit the pattern. But the toddler, through DNA, later was connected to a female remains found seven miles away uh, across the line in Tanessa County. Was, is she involved in the uh, sex business? Maybe. We're assuming that she was. And uh, people in the business and people that have... Uh, you know, are very familiar with the prostitution business, tell us that, uh, you know, a sex worker will bring a youngster with them sometimes when they meet a client. This case is not cold. Uh, you know, I don't like that term uh, because it indicates that we've given up on it and that it's put in a file drawer someplace. Uh, not true. Uh, the detectives uh, in our forensics unit and the homicide squad are still working diligently on leads that we uh, received after the last press conference. We do know that this person uh, is organized, is methodical in what they do, rather than a disorganized uh, killer. Uh, you know, but uh, again, there's all sorts of theories about what kind of person this, uh, this killer is. And I tell people all the time that uh, when we do catch the person, everybody will be surprised.